Yeah, 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 yeah. Welcome to Chef Daddy on Junior's Cooking Network. Today we're doing some ackee and sawfish and some bok choy and parsley with okra and sawfish and provision. So we do it. Look at this. We have some pumpkin. We have some parsley. We have the bok choy. We have some okra. We have Irish. We have jumbo yam. We have sweet potato. We have some carrot, we have the sawfish, we have the ackee, we have some green banana, and we have some unbleached all-purpose flour. Look at that. Right now we're just washing off the provisions that we can put it in the pot and boil it up. We're going to cut them up and peel them and I saw it did. Big up. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you're liking this video so far. Bless up. Now we're going to put the dumpling in the pot. Look at that. This is called all purpose on bleach flour so we do it big up one love we're putting it in the bubbling pot aka boiling pot look at that looking lovely already one love i hope you guys are enjoying the video please go sub like and share but first of all make sure you enjoy share it worldwide wherever you are log in tap in and enjoy you know bless up one love we have the irish and the jumbo yam and the banana cut so we're doing it now we're going to put them in the pot look at that we have the carrot and the sweet potato and the jumbo jam ready look at that now they're all going into the pot slowly but surely looking lovely already so we do it a nice we like a nice and clean stove a nice and clean pot a nice and clean cooking look at that looking lovely already nice and clean bananas nice and clean irish look at that looking lovely big up people worldwide wherever you are watching this one love stay safe big up yeah man so we do it look at that the bok chai and the okra washing and looking dashing so we do it big up one love look at that everything sliced up and cut up and ready for steam down look at this so we do it big up one love people look at that now we're going to put the pumpkin in the pot because we don't want it to cook too long or it's going to get soft and broke up in the pot so we don't want that so we just put it in close to last and so we do it big up now we have the sawfish ready to bubble up and boil up and then combine with the ackee after the ackee is ready. So we do it. Look at that. The provisions coming along wonderfully. Look at that. The sawfish is bubbling. We boil it about three or four times so we get the salt out. We want to just warm up the ackee and then drain it and then combine that and the sawfish together so we do it big up one love easy like that look at this looking lovely now we're going to put the beet root in because we still want it to be crunchy and not too soft so we are doing it big up one love easy cooking one two three you don't know one love people beet root is good for you you can drink it you can eat it raw you can blend it you can bake it it's good for blood big up one love look at this we have purple onion white onion we have tomatoes we have some you know ginger and stuff right now we're going to use some bicell vegan butter look at that looking lovely wonderful look at that nice and lovely instead of using oil we're trying to cut the calories a little bit we have some ginger here and we have some garlic we're gonna give the flavor to the pot big up one love so we do it yeah 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 now we're frying up the vegetables a little bit sauteing it a little bit Look at that, looking lovely. Now 
Now we're going to add the ackee to the sawfish and the sauteed vegetables. Now we're going to make it simmer and steam down a little bit. Um, it should be ready. Everything is cooked already in this pot, so it won't take so long. We go. One log. So we do it. Look at that. Looking lovely already. Wow. Now we're going to season it with some secret seasoning here. Big up. Give it a nice flavor. Nice yardy flavor. So we do it. Now we're going to add some black pepper. Look at that. Courtesy of Irie. Big up Irie, you know. Irie have no flaws with their seasoning. It come together well with the food. Big up. One love. Now we're going to add some miracle purpose seasoning, all purpose seasoning. Look at that, looking lovely. Look at it, looking nice and lovely already. Wow, you should smell this, people. Lovely, 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 lovely. Some scotch bonnet is cut up nice and fine in there. So you can smell the scotch bonnet. Yeah, now we have the ginger and the vegetable, then the tomato, the scallion, the purple onion. Look at it, looking lovely already. And the okra and the bok chai combining together right now. Looking nice and well and healthy. Look at that, we're using some garlic right now on the food here, some powder garlic. Look at that, garlic pepper. Now we're gonna use some miracle all-purpose seasoning again. Looking lovely. We're not going to use no salt in this dish because there's salt already in the sawfish. Now we're going to put the sawfish and combine it with the greenery for the scenery. Look at that. Looking lovely. Wonderful combination. Sawfish, bok chai, and okra. Lovely. The provision is ready. The ackee is ready. And the bok chai, sawfish, and okra is ready. Look at that. Thanks for watching. Thanks for supporting my channel. The food is ready to be chowed down and it's in the plate. One love people. Hope you enjoyed this short little presentation video. Hopefully you can cook some food like this and enjoy. One love. Yeah man, so we do it.